Hi there, once again welcome back to my channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. In today's lesson, I'm going to walk you through how to merge two email addresses into one. So as you can see from my screen, I've actually merged two email accounts together. Okay, so any email that will be sent to this particular account to equally be sent here. So if you check this part, I say forward a copy of incoming email to this. That is adjutech at gmail.com. And equally, this is that email. So any email that will come into this account will be reflected here as well. So if I go to my inbox, from my inbox, this is my inbox for my main Gmail account. Look at the first message and look at this. Okay. If you check the me that's meta for business and you check your meta for business, that means I receive message from those two accounts equal messages okay so i've measured two and this will save you a lot of time mostly when you create an account with gmail it gives you access to 15 gig space where you can store your files in google drive okay so when you're running out of space you can create additional one they have a paid version where you can upgrade but if you don't have money to afford that then it's very good you create another account and merge the two together so if i go back and then check this i've exhausted about 82 percent but I don't want to waste much time. I don't want to make this video look too long. Let's go ahead and try merging Gmail, two Gmail accounts together. So in this case, I have another Gmail account here called adutech88 at gmail.com. This is a new one. So I want to just merge this one to my main Gmail account. So let's jump right into action. So in order to do this, just click on settings. So the gear icon at the far right, just click on that. See all settings. Clicking on serious after clicking on serious set is going to bring you to this page. And when you click on account and import, you can equally see the size of your Gmail account, the size that is left. Okay. So when it's in terms of storage space, this is what is left. I've used 82%. That's 12.3 gig out of my 15 gig. So can you equally create a new account and then save some files in your drive? Okay. So in order to merge the two, just go to forwarding and what's pop slash imap so click on that so you can see from here i've already added this is my email this is the email i've already merged with the main one okay so this one is part of the list of i i think okay so i made two as well so this is adjutech 360 gmail.com so i've made these two to the main one so i have three in one now so i'm going to walk you throughout to make additional one so in order to do that just click on add a forwarding address okay from this part click on add a forwarding address so i'll click on that and then it's going to give you this new dialog but just type the email you want to add as a forwarding address so i've done that and i'll just click on next So it's going to give you an option. It's going to reload and then forward you back. So just give yourself some time for this to load. Click on proceed. So when this is done, you should be getting some message like this. A confirmation code has been sent to your, that's the image you are trying to match. It will give you this message. So just click on that. Okay. Click on that you can see verify the email. So the email you so the email you are trying to merge to your main email account, you have to first verify that. So you have to go into that account and get a verification code. So in this case, this is the email I'm trying to merge. I'll just reload this page to get that email. So I've indeed received the confirmation email. Just open it. Pin that and then you can just read a few messages. Okay. Ajotech, that's ajotechtimothy.sky at gmail.com has requested to automatically forward mail to your email. So there's the email that will be forwarded here. So I just go ahead and copy the activation code, which I need in order to do this. So I'll go back to where I'm doing my settings and then paste that code over here. Okay. So that is what we need next. And then click on verify. So our verification is successful now and it should be part of the list here now. That is the Adjutech. 
So you can see now Agitech 88 at gmail.com has actually been added now. So any email that will be sent to this particular email, email address will be forwarded into our main email. So you don't need to so you don't need to always have your main email with you. You can give this one, you can give this one to anyone at all. Once they sent email, you equally get it in your main email account. Okay. Remember to like and share if you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumb. Give me a thumb up so that YouTube can recommend this video to more people to watch. Okay. So you equally have a very good space here on your other email address to store files on your drive. So as many as you have, you can easily store files in that particular Gmail account. Thank you so much for watching this video. It's like come your way again. Remember to always like and share because there are a lot of tips and tricks that I'm going to be showing you how to filter and block email addresses. The people try to spam you can easily do all those things. So there's a lot of videos coming up. Subscribe and turn on the post notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Till I come your way again. Bye bye.